Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So, at the end of November, as I posted, Microsoft confirmed a narrator issue when clean installing Windows 11 version 23H2, which as many of you will know by now is our latest feature update. And quick recap, Narrator is a screen reader that describes what's on your screen and obviously is a handy and useful accessibility feature. Now, as I mentioned in that video, which I'll leave a link to in the description, Microsoft had mentioned that when using physical media or disk images, uh, disk image ISO files to install Windows 11 version 23H2, Microsoft Narrator may not start. So obviously this was posing a problem for some users who needed Narrator and need Narrator during the initial OOBE out-of-box experience and setup of Windows 11 version 23H2. And something just to take note of, as I have mentioned previously, is that it was only affecting Narrator during the setup uh, process. After the initial setup process was complete, Narrator would work and um, function as expected. Now, something else um, Microsoft did mention from the official known issue is that it does not occur when Windows 11 version 23H2 is installed using Windows Update on a device which is already running Windows 10 or Windows 11. It was only affecting devices um, using ISO image files in the initial setup process doing a clean install of Windows 11 23H2. Now, if you were affected and are affected by this issue, um, maybe you need Narrator as an accessibility feature to be able to do a clean installation of Windows 11 version 23H2 or in-place upgrade, then Microsoft has announced that on the 19th of December, which was just a couple of days ago, they have rolled out a new file that is now available, an image file to create an installation media to update to Windows 11 version 23H2. And the new um, ISO media, they say, does not encounter this issue and contains the December 2023 security update, which is KB5033375. So if you'd like to download the latest um, ISO image uh, to do an in-place upgrade or a clean installation of Windows 11 to resolve this issue, then head over to the download Windows 11 page, which I'll leave in the description for easy access and reference. And as many of you may know, this is where you can download a Windows 11 disk image ISO file uh, to create a bootable installation using a USB flash drive or a DVD, just to mention two examples. You click on the link and you follow the instructions. And if you do need some further instructions on this, about this whole process and how to go about it, you just click on this uh, little um, link and you get all the information you will need to simplify the process of installing Windows 11 version 23H2 using the disk image ISO image file. So if you were affected and are affected by that issue, just wanted to keep you in the loop um, where that narrator failing to start in the OOBE experience has now been resolved. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.